we've interviewed a large number of patients and asked them to describe their perception of uh, stroke risk and their perception of the benefit of oral anticoagulation to reduce that risk. The objective of this study was to identify if there is a disparity between patients' perception of their stroke risk without oral anticoagulation and their bleeding risk with, with oral anticoagulation compared with what we would predict based on the commonly utilized scores, namely the CHAD-VASC and the HAS-BLED score. We found that the vast majority of patients with atrial fibrillation actually overestimate their annual risk of stroke. Uh, specifically, we found that over 20% of patients believe that their annual risk of stroke is over 50%. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.